Hey guys, it's YB and Herbert. Today is very special. I am so hungry, but first let me introduce you. This is a Korean feast. I made some of them and some of them I ordered, but basically this is like Korean junk food, but also like meal. Let's go through each one. This is bulgogi. Everyone knows that probably. It's Herbert's favorite. <laughs> and this is pork dumplings. Um, we'll, we call it mandu. It's called like water dumpling for us because you cook it in boiled water. If it's a fried one, we call it kunmandu, which means fried dumplings. But this is bulmandu, water dumplings, because it was boiled in hot water. Some rice, kimchi, some side dishes. This is tteokbokki, um, spicy rice cake, my favorite. And I made some, um, it's called kimmari in Korean. It's like fried seaweed roll. There's some like noodles and stuff in it. It's really good. And this is fish cake, fish cake soup actually. So usually people eat the fish cake soup with the tteokbokki. It's like a kind of like a pairing in Korea. Are you ready to I'm dig ready. in? All right, let's go. I'm gonna get some tteokbokki. I love this so much. We should try this um, fried seaweed thingy. So inside are like glass noodles. It's really good. <laughs> so good. They sell it on the streets. Mm -hmm. This is all street food. Except maybe bulgogi, but... Fast food then? Oh no. Yeah, it's like fast food. But it's healthy. Like it's healthy. not healthy, but it's better than a. It's not I healthy? Guess. No, I mean this is rice cake. It's like all carbs. The sauce is made with like, like, sugar and <laughs> chili. I mean it's not like as bad as, I guess American street food. It's better than a donut, probably. <laughs> I don't know. It's a good comparison. <laughs> this is fish cake. Eat this with rice cake, it's really good. In the soup. You wanna try the soup? What's that? It's like a brain. No, it's not a brain. <laughs> well, I'm finally, spinning. I get some brain. <laughs> <laughs> and? Uh. Um, that's. <laughs> Interesting. You don't like it? Something between meat and fish. Meat fish. It's like a fish pie. Like a fish meat. I love this. What's your favorite Korean food that you've tried so far? Mm. I do like the bulgogi. I can't lie. Mm -hmm. So that's good. It's a classic. If it's too spicy, it's a little bit tough for me. So everything was not spicy, it's actually pretty good. <laughs> Yeah, it's a good taste. Korean food is mostly. I mean, it's not all spicy. Do you guys have like different food in different regions, or is it? Um, yeah, but I think overall it's pretty similar. This is like overall. Yeah, this is definitely everywhere. Okay. It's like traditional Korean food. If we did German food, what would you bring out on the plate? I would bring for sure some bratwurst, mm -hmm. sausage, sausage, you know. Sausage. Probably some klöße. I like them. Mm. Which is like potato balls. Mm -hmm. then, That's my favorite. What else? Just eat it with spoon, right? <laughs> it's freaking me out. Yeah. <laughs> Actually good. I made it. You made it? Mm -hmm. Well, I fried it. That's cooking, right? Yeah. My favorite Korean food is definitely this. Tteokbokki and ramen, honestly. So you should just You need one of those? This because I'm there. gonna put it in there. Why don't you put that in there? That might be a better idea. That's the Korean way, by the way. If there's any kind of like soup left over, yeah. you just put rice in it and eat it with rice. That makes sense. 
Even if it's like ramen broth left over yeah, or it's a rice soup. Yeah. I'm definitely gonna eat this later with rice. Mm -hmm. Nah. Mm. Hi Tyrion, come here. Oh, come here. We have a special guest. I gave her a bath today and she was like screaming in the bathtub. But yep. she likes me again apparently. Good girl, come here. Come up here. Herbert's too busy eating to appreciate this cuteness. <laughs> well, a lot happened well. What happened? Uh oh, I have a feeling. Oh. Uh oh, she's gonna come I up. <laughs> Where's Louis? I'm surprised he hasn't come over oh, here. Louis! Mm. Oh. Now it's so when should we go to Korea together? Mm, that's a good question. So I was born in Seoul, which is like a big city. It's like New York, the capital of Korea. But the thing is, when I was there, I was pretty young. I was only there till like, I was 12. So I never got to like experience the like adult life because I'm sure that's a lot different than like being a kid there, you know? Mm. Um, and then was Louis's hair flying. I visited Korea for the first time in 10 years this summer, as you know. No way. <laughs> Is there a video of it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll do what I do best, eating. So I'll show you guys what I eat on this island and all the experiences I have. So come with me. Yeah, but I asked when <laughs> we came <laughs> together. No, but I was just trying to tell you a story. It's, it's a continuing story. When I visited, my, par I, my parents now live in Jeju, which is like the island, right? It's more like a countryside. There are still like city areas and stuff there, but it's not like Seoul. When I visited the summer, it was in Jeju, not Seoul. So basically, I haven't been to like the main areas of Korea, the main cities, since I was like 12. So when we were to visit, Korea, we should probably go to the main cities, right? Because you want to see like the life there. I want to see where you grew up. Oh. What makes you to the person who you are today? I don't know if... Isn't that more like high school? Let's go to high school then. I don't want to go to high school. But the thing is, if I brought you to Korea, I couldn't show you much because I don't even know anything. <laughs> like, I'm gonna be a tourist too. Yeah. I heard Seoul nightlife is crazy. Yeah. Like, I heard people party till like 6 a.m. But you guys do that in Germany too. Tyrion is pooping right next to us in the her letter box. Great cat. Looks like we finished most of it. Yeah, I like the bulgogi. <laughs> yeah, I could tell. <laughs> and the dumplings were good. I think... Um, that's the sound of Tyrion using her litter box. I've never seen her like... Eyesight. <laughs> you hear the, doing it. Did you hear the drop of the poop? Yeah, like some major issues, huh? Today. <laughs> no, she's burying it. It's so cool that cat's like Louis watching too. Yeah, learn from her. Yeah, learn from her, Louis. Overall, it's, it's a very good meal and it actually it feels kind of healthy. I don't know, I don't feel bloated yeah, or anything. That's true. I do, but that's because I ate a lot. <laughs> you think? <sighs> I'm full. I want to take a nap. Let's do that. But yeah, we will go to Korea some someday and next time maybe we'll do a german version of this and then herbert's gonna host that one because yeah. that's your food deal deal and you have to cook deal <laughs> okay well thanks guys for watching hope you enjoyed it and i really encourage if you haven't to try all these foods especially the spicy rice cake tteokbokki and 
bulgogi, dumplings, kimchi, everything. Honestly, everything is really good. So, until next time. Until next time. Alright.